Greetings, Galactic Coders! It's Astronaut B once again, charting the course for today's coding odyssey. Our voyage today will help you understand how to use logical operators and and or within if statements. By the closure of today's expedition, not only will you have harnessed the prowess to stitch together complex conditions, but you'll be ready to tackle our hands-on task, Asteroid Prediction 1. So fasten your seatbelts, for we're about to unravel the coding cosmos. Decisions often aren't just straightforward, they can hinge on multiple factors. Here's where our logical operators AND and OR play the pivotal role. Let's first take a look at the AND operator. The AND operator is placed between two conditions. Each condition is checked individually, and if both conditions are true, the whole condition becomes true and the code block will execute. But if even one of the conditions is false, the whole condition becomes false and the code block will be skipped. Imagine you are a galactic gatekeeper safeguarding a space highway. Your ship is only allowed to pass if its speed is less than 50 and if you have at least one space token to pay for passage. In this snippet, Access to the highway is granted only when we are traveling at a speed less than 50 and have one or more space tokens. The AND operator ensures both conditions are met before granting access. As you can see, it's not good enough just to have the token if your speed isn't slow enough. Next, let's take a look at how the OR operator works. The OR operator is again placed between two conditions, just like the AND operator. Each condition is checked individually, and if either condition is true, the whole condition becomes true and the code block will execute. The only way the code block is skipped is if both conditions are false. At the Space Amusement Park, patrons gain entry either if their status is equal to Season Pass or if they pay the entry fee equal to three space tokens. In this example, a patron is allowed entry to the space amusement park if they are either a season pass holder or they pay the entry fee of three space tokens. The OR operator facilitates entry when at least one of these conditions is true. In fact, if the patron was both a season pass holder and had the three tokens to pay the entry fee, the if statement would still be true. With OR, if both are true, the whole statement is still true. Sometimes we have even more complex statements that require the use of both the AND and OR operators. When doing so, it is important to use parentheses when necessary in order to make sure operations occur in the order you would like them to. I have been tasked to pilot the spaceship this afternoon and evening, but I get a break from 3 o'clock to 4 o'clock and from 8 o'clock to 9 o'clock. Let's write an if statement to represent this. We will start by defining the range of my first break. My break is from 3 o'clock to 4 o'clock, so we can write if time is greater than or equal to 3 and time is less than or equal to 4, I'm on break. But we also have another range of times I am on break. My second break is from 8 o'clock to 9 o'clock. We can write this condition as if time is greater than or equal to 8 and time is less than or equal to 9. Now. Since both time ranges can't happen at the same time, we use OR to combine them. Either my break is between 3 and 4, OR my break is between 8 and 9. If the time is greater than 3 and less than 4, or the time is greater than 8 and less than 9, I'll take a break. 
Now, gear up, spacefarers, for it's time to tackle a cosmic conundrum in our task, Asteroid Prediction 1. Open that task up and let's get started coding together. In this task, a rogue asteroid is on a collision course with our planet. Our mission is to decipher whether it poses a threat to one of the trees we have planted, located at the coordinates x, y. When it looks as if the collision will happen, our code must initiate the shoot function to thwart the impending collision. Use the AND and OR operators to create a set of conditions that will initiate the shoot command when necessary. We will need to check if both the x-coordinate and the y-coordinate match the trajectory of the asteroid. Which logical operator checks if both conditions are true? That's right, the AND operator. Fill in the rest of the code and protect our newly planted tree. Then you can try the next asteroid prediction tasks. Bravo, interstellar explorers! Today's journey showed us the benefits of using two logical operators, AND and OR, within IF statements. We learned that two conditions that use the AND operator only result in true if both conditions are true. Then we saw that two conditions that use the OR operator result in true if at least one of the conditions is true. We then saw how we can combine both the AND and OR logical operators to form even more complex IF statements. Be sure to complete the programming tasks, practice questions, and extension activities before moving on to the next lesson. Remember, in the universe of coding, the possibilities are infinite. I'll see you next time. Hey, hey.